Hi everyone, Dean Somerset here. Uh, I wanted to show you a reactive stability drop exercise I use with some of my clients. Now this is something that has very quick speed development with it, but the goal on this isn't necessarily to move quickly, but to resist moving quickly. So what I'm gonna get Ian to do is grab on, walk forward, and he's gonna put his feet up into my hands while trying to keep his hips up. You don't have to uh, sh uh, row up there, but you just have to keep your feet up, keep your hips up strong. Now what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna let go of a leg. His goal is to not drop to the side that that leg goes. So it can be very much independent on which leg I want to let go and I can make it random. So if he puts more weight onto one foot versus the other, if I let that foot go, he's got to rotate. So he can't really anticipate what's going on. I'm feeling the tone and tension in his feet and he's just got to be able to brace and stay stable the entire time. Try not to let your foot drop even an inch. Uh-oh, come on man, keep those hips up. Now you can work with a lot of variation on this with clients. So it works really well with athletes, also works really well with anybody who's got a decent level of strength that wants to just work on control and have some fun with it. Good. So that's a quick example of a reactive stability exercise just using drops. You can do that on a TRX, on rings, on a bar, whatever you like. But it is very much a partner-assisted exercise and works really well to build in the value of your services. Cool. Thanks.